This is a fascinating true tale of same-sex love that happened way back in the 19th century in sunny Spain. Now you might think that same-sex marriage was impossible back then, but hold on to your hats, because this story will defy all your expectations. Our story starts with two young women, Marcela Gracia, a tender 18 years old, and Elisa Sanchez, a seasoned 22-year-old, who met while studying to be teachers in a Karuna, a picturesque town in the Galicia region. They struck up a friendship that quickly blossomed into something more, a romantic flame that burned bright in their hearts. But alas, their families did not approve of their love, and Marcella was whisked away to Madrid in the hope that distance would quench her feelings for Elisa. Yet, as you might have guessed, it didn't work. Once Marcella finished her studies, she returned to her beloved A. Karuna and reunited with her heart's desire. Years went by, and their love only grew stronger. And so, they hatched a daring plan to get married. Elisa, bless her heart, disguised herself as a man named Mario Sanchez, and they made up a story about him living in London. On June 8, 1901, they tied the knot in San Jorge's church in A. Karuna, with all the pomp and circumstance that such a momentous occasion deserved. Unfortunately, their secret was not safe for long, and soon they faced persecution from the press, lost their jobs, and were excommunicated from the church. To top it all off, an arrest warrant was issued against them. They fled to Portugal, where they were arrested but released due to the support of the Portuguese press. However, Spain was still hot on their trail, and so they made a daring escape to Argentina, taking on new identities. By this time, as if by miracle, Marcela had become a mother of a daughter. Once in Buenos Aires, their lives took another unexpected turn. Elisa, much to everyone's surprise, married a man much older than herself, but their marriage was doomed from the start due to her refusal to engage in physical intimacy with him. As for Marcella and her child, the details are lost to the sands of time. According to Elisa, Marcella became pregnant by a young man who refused to acknowledge paternity, and they came up with the marriage scheme to help with the pregnancy. The other theory is that Marcella intentionally became pregnant with another man to fulfill their dream of being parents. Whatever the truth may be, the story of Marcella and Elisa lives on to this day, inspiring books and even a movie. For they were true pioneers, daring to love in a world that was not ready to accept them. And though they may have suffered for their love, they also showed us all what it truly means to be brave.